Hi, Gemini. This is how they feel for August the 24th through August the 25th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Gemini for August the 24th through August the 25th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Gemini for August the 24th through August the 25th, 2023. Universal energies. Show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Gemini for August the 24th through August the 25th, 2023. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. So Gemini, this is how they feel. And their crowning energy is the Eight of Cups. How they feel about you is the Ten of Pentacles. And the King of Cups. What's in their environment is the Queen of Swords, you, and the Four of Swords. So listen, Gemini, this is in their environment. This may not be linked to you. It may be external to you. We'll see if it links. The Eight of Cups in reverse. I'm sorry, I'm about to say in reverse. The Eight of Cups in their crown and energy. Okay, this is someone who's walking away or detaching emotionally from a situation. Clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's partner, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's partner, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's partner, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's partner, clarify the Eight of Cups. For Gemini's partner, it is clarified with the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So listen, something may have been slow going. Maybe they felt like they didn't feel anything growing or nurturing here, being stable here or something committed. They didn't just didn't feel that. They just didn't feel it. Hmm. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles for Gemini's partner. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles for Gemini's partner. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles for Gemini's partner. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Oh. This is someone who's not stable, someone who's not reliable, dependable, someone who's not rooted or grounded, someone who's not investing here. Could be someone going through a divorce or legal separation here. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Gemini's person. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Gemini's person. Clarify the Queen of Pentacles for Gemini's person. The hermit in reverse. <sighs> Someone who doesn't have any guidance here. Someone who may be coming out of isolation here. Someone who wasn't using their intuition. Clarify the hermit for Gemini's person. Clarify the hermit for Gemini's person. Clarify the hermit for Gemini's person. Uh -huh. Eight of swords. Someone who's stuck. Stuck in their mind here. Stuck in their mind. They feel like they don't have any guidance here. You know, trapped by their thoughts. Concerning some type of commitment or stability that's falling apart here. Someone could be going through a legal separation or divorce here. There's just no stability and they're detaching emotionally and walking away from the situation. They just don't feel like they have clear guidance here. Queen of Swords here. This can be someone who's getting to the truth of things, cutting through the matter, cutting someone out. This can be legal documentation or paperwork or communication here. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Gemini's person. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Gemini's person. Clarify the Queen of Swords for Gemini's person. The Emperor in reverse. Someone who's not confident here, who's not taking control here. Feel like they're losing control of a situation. Clarify the emperor. 
for Gemini's person. Clarify the Emperor for Gemini's person. Clarify the Emperor for Gemini's person over here. Two of Swords. Someone who's maybe indecisive here, doesn't know enough information, who may be in two minds concerning something, but they're just feeling like they don't have control of a situation. When it comes to maybe some type of legal documentation or paperwork or cutting something out, I feel like they don't have any guidance, that they're stuck in their mind here. They're walking away emotionally, but maybe still have to deal with the fallout or of the legal side of coming out of some type of commitment here. Four swords here, putting something to rest or meditating on something, or even trying to heal or recover. Clarify the Four of Swords for Gemini's person. Clarify the Four of Swords for Gemini's person. Clarify the Four of Swords for Gemini's person. The Chariot in Reverse. They don't feel like they have any control. They're not in control. They're not confident here, and maybe not making a move forward here. They're lacking confidence about something here. Clarify the chariot for Gemini's person. Clarify the chariot for Gemini's person. Clarify the chariot for Gemini's person. Two of cups in reverse. A relationship or a connection is falling apart here. They don't have any confidence in the relationship. They're putting it to rest. This is what they're meditating on. This is the, what they're stuck in their thoughts about and two minds about. They don't have any conf confidence concerning it. Wanting to cut things off here. Maybe wanting to file some type of legal documentation or paperwork. This commitment has fallen apart. There is no stability here, but they don't have any guidance. They just know that they're pulling away their emotional energy here. How they feel or think about you or how you're actually feeling or thinking over here. Since a well, I'm on Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. This is abundant success, family, commitment, marriage. I clarify the Ten of Pentacles for Gemini's person. Clarify the Ten of Pentacles for Gemini's person. Clarify the Ten of Pentacles for Gemini's person concerning Gemini over here. Two of Pentacles. Right. Now, Gemini, this can be how you feel or how they're feel how they're thinking that you're feeling, okay? Someone could be up and down in their emotions concerning commitment, you know, maybe back and forth one minute they're cold and hot or up and down. And I feel it here. It's like so, just don't know, just don't know where we stand here. Very well could be that this commitment is ending because someone was juggling here. Someone's unstable. This is an unstable commitment here or you feel like it's unstable king of cups someone who has a great deal of love here but someone who's trying to master their emotions here okay maybe not even letting anyone see them sweat but a great deal of love here clarify the king of cups for gemini's person clarify the king of cups for gemini's person clarify the king of cups a Gemini's person concerning Gemini, the Hierophant, commitment here, forgiveness here. Hmm. Clarify the Hierophant, a Gemini's person, religious differences and values. Clarify the Hierophant, for Gemini's person. Clarify the Hierophant, for Gemini's person concerning Gemini over here. Page of Cups in reverse. So someone's not apologizing here. Someone is not showing love here or coming in, offering love here, retracting their offer of love here, not feeling the love. Clarify the page of cups for Gemini's person. Clarify the page of cups for Gemini's person. Clarify the page of cups for Gemini's person. Knight of Cups. Now, this is someone who's coming in with this offer of love here or an apology. Some type of romantic gesture. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Gemini's person. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Gemini's person. This is crazy. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Gemini's person concerning Gemini. <clears throat> eight of Cups. The same Eight of Cups. <clears throat> Walking away. Did someone turn down an offer of love or commitment or offer to forgive here? Hmm. 
Is it that you're saying that you, you love this person, but you have to master your emotions here? Because when it comes to commitment here, maybe you're just not ready for it, or they think that you're not ready for it. You may have turned down their offer of love. Someone may have been just in two minds here concerning commitment here. And this person also feels like, I don't know where we stand. I'm lost in my thoughts. I'm not confident here. This relationship is falling apart. There is no commitment. We're falling out of a commitment, lack of commitment or stability going forward. And someone's walking away. Is it that there is a walking away because someone doesn't know if they really want this? Gemini, I'm going to take a look at the Twin Flames exposed for your partner. I'm going to get three cards on their thoughts, feelings, and confessions. And two cards on your thoughts, feelings, or confessions. Or how they're actually thinking or feeling concerning you, Gemini. Hmm. Everything always points back to you, Gemini. Everything. I said everything. What else? <laughs> for Gemini's person. What else? For Gemini's person. Hmm. When you cut me off, my world fell apart. So did you cut them off? Did you turn them down? Did you say, you know what? I'm tired of this up and down about commitment here. So I'm just kind of detaching. Hmm. What else? For Gemini's person. What else for Gemini's person? I'm pretending not to care, but that could be further from the truth. They're trying to play hard, but they care. Two cards on your thoughts, feelings, or confessions, or how they actually think or feel concerning you, Gemini. I miss hearing your voice and getting your text messages every day. You guys may not be speaking to one another. Could have been some type of cutting off and a blocking here of communication. What else for Gemini? What else for Gemini? Hmm. Sitting here by myself thinking on what to say. Now, they can be saying this to you or you them. But it is being said that I'm sitting here by myself thinking of what to say. I miss hearing your voice and getting your text messages every day. Everything always points back to you. When you cut me off, my world fell apart. I'm pretending not to care, but that could be further from the truth. I still care. You cut them off? You're not talking to them? Hmm. I'm going to take a look at the lover's oracle for you, Gemini. Only time will tell. Only time will tell. Mm. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Gemini, this is how they feel for August the 24th through August the 25th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at herimmortalmaj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.